Hi friends, my name is Raj and you are watching TechWhite. So in this video, I will show you how to connect custom domain with Google Sites. Uh, you can see this is my website which I created in Google Sites. So in this video, I will show you how to connect a custom domain with Google Sites. So I am uh, using a custom domain of GoDaddy. Uh, first, I will open GoDaddy page. The domain name which I am going to be use is healthyandcaring.com. So in this video, I will show you how to set up custom domain. So right now I am using a free domain of Google Sites. Uh, this is a free domain of uh, Google Sites which I am currently using. So I will show you how to set up. Go to the setting icon, click on it. Now on the left side, go to custom domains, click on it. Now you have to click on start setup. Now I am using a third party uh, domain. So I will choose this option. Next. Now I have to enter my domain name here. So I will copy my domain name. I will paste it here. Now you can see, uh, first you have to verify your ownership. So uh, click on the option, verify your ownership. So after that, scroll down and you have to click on add a C name record. Click on it. Now you have to copy the first address. This one. Now what we have to do is we will open GoDaddy DNS page and we will create a CNAME entry here. Go to your GoDaddy website. This is the domain name which I am going to be use. Now you have to choose DNS option. Now you have to click on add to add a CNAME record. Make sure there is no other CNAME entry here. Click on add on the type section. You have to choose a C name record in the name section. You have to copy the first address, which I already copied in the value section. You have to copy the second address, copy, go to the DNS page in the value section, paste it here in the TTL. We'll choose half an hour and click on add record successfully added now refresh your code ID website so you can see the CNAME entry has been added okay now go to the webmaster center and now after adding the CNAME entry click on verify Uh, wait for a few uh, seconds and I will refresh it again. Try. Here you can see. Good job. Uh, this domain name has been verified successfully. Now, again, uh, click on the setting option, setting icon. Go to custom domain, click on start setup, choose third party, then click on next. Now I have to enter my domain name here again. So I will copy and paste it here. Click on next. Now here you can see you have to add another CNAME entry on your GoDaddy DNS uh, configuration. So on the value section, you have to type www on the destination. You have to type this, uh, this address. I will copy the address till the dot 
copy go to your godaddy dns column scroll down so i have to and uh, add another cname record click on add on the type section choose cname on the name section you have to type www three times on the value section you have to paste the address you can see uh, this address on the ttl i will choose half an hour and now click on add record successfully added that's it now refresh the page it's very important to refresh your page after adding any record in dns so now go to the google sites tab again now click on done so now you can see my domain name www.healthyandcaring.com has been added in google sites that's it you can see this is my url now if i try to check the domain name is working or not currently it is not working we have to wait for one or two hours so i will pause this video and rest we will check after the domain name is live so after half an hour my website is live now my custom domain is working fine you can see healthyandcaring.com is now live and it's working fine so i will give you three important tips first uh, make sure uh, if you are using web console center make sure you are using with same gmail id okay and in the dns configuration make sure there is no other cname entry okay and my last and final tip if your custom url is not working you have to check go to this shared icon click on it and make sure your publish site option will be choose as public so these are the three tips so thank you thanks for watching techwide have a nice day